And we have returned yet again. Going back to town, see the mission. Send the chimera, sell stuff, you know, the usual drill. The Cult of Seven tore a wound in the fabric of the ink and created another ink rift, similar to the one we've dealt with before. This one is much bigger, and it opens into a realm of much more dangerous creatures. Great. Tell me we weren't caught by surprise again. Not this time. We've already moved some traps from our outpost to the Empyrean perimeter, and we're able to install them near the rift in I'll time. put one of our captains to the task. Yep. Well then, if you nice like your chances, you can go rules. there. What do you think? Let's just send the chimera again. Feed it, let's say, an ethereal essence. That's good. And go and farm me some gold. We actually got a legendary item. Yes, we did. I, kn I know we got one of them. What is it? The Calc... The Calctron pack. Interesting. We'll leave it in the stash and I'll, s and I'll see off stream. Is it any better than the one that we are using right now? Oh, doors closed on us. Oh, quick. I might have something for you. Anything else you need to sell? Ah, time to teach him a lesson. Give me this. And let's return to the Shrine of Lamentation and proceed to the Tower of Torment. And there was a time when I thought that Nightmare Hollow was a bleak place. Our goal is simple. We go to the tower and find the gate that leads to that void cathedral. How far is it? It's far. Then. Well, he doesn't seem very happy. That was probably a quest. Should have accepted it, but oh well, alas. So many things in this game you can overlook. It might be actually quite impossible to get all of them or all of them on your first playthrough. Oh, 
When the hell did... When the hell did you show up? Poor Sylvester. Bring around the demon shooting but choppers in the background. That's a lot of demon dogs. <laughs> what? <laughs> and we were just and we were just talking about <laughs> Dante a couple of minutes ago. Guidebook to hell. <laughs> oh. Well done. Fencing the cult of the massive attack. The city apart. You must flare. Okay, let's go. I'm glad you could make it back, Van Helsing. We have a hefty decision to make. What is it, Commander? It is a well-kept secret that shortly before his fall, Professor Fulmagapi almost finished his most diabolical invention, the Chaos Engine. It would have been a machine capable of destabilizing the barrier between the ink and our world. I am aware. What of it? The unfinished prototype was destroyed during the revolution, and we thought we'd seen the last of it. Until now, the Cult of Seven have somehow rebuilt the machine, and they're using it to accelerate the changes happening all over Borgoba. If we're still to have a city by the time you defeat the Faceless Tsar, our forces must take it down. That means sending our elite teams on two extremely dangerous missions. I thought you might want to make this decision yourself. Hmm. I trust your judgment, Commander. Choose the best men for the task. I have bigger fish to fry. Understood. Sergeant Sarovich, gather your men and prepare for the assault on the Chaos Engine. Baron Umpir, I'm giving you command of the rest of the elite forces. Begin planning the diversionary offensive. There we go. Uh, back to the, back to the Tower of Torment. It's kind of weird that they don't allow you to do, do that mission yourself. You can do all of the other missions alone by yourself. Interrogate this cousin. Uh, oh, there's a silver treasure just there. Ooh. Just clear these bastards before we talk to the cousin. My cousin is a jailer now in an evil mastermind's dungeon, or so I heard. Yes. Your hero has returned from a successful hunt. Return to the lair to receive the spoils of the hunt. In an evil mastermind's dungeon. Completely. I am an evil mastermind. 
He has been tormenting people with, with poems and songs. Much like the people from the Serbian Turbo Folk history. He's very effective. Actually, not go that way. Need to wait a little bit more. Don't have enough rage. Turret, for fuck's sake, shoot! Thank you. This bastard is giving me so much trouble. Thank you very much, Katarina. Helping me clean the trash. Become the fallen warlord. Interesting. That looks like the cross. So, kill that sucky bit. Thing. Die. Thank you. Let's see what Nihelm says. The Fallen Warlord. Stop there, gallant knight. My name is Lord Nihelm, Supreme Commander of the Steel Legion. I'm on a sacred quest to obtain and wield the Reaper Blade of the Titans. Have you seen it? Sorry. Your legion was crushed more than 400 years ago. <laughs> Look. That blade is at least four times taller than you. Nonsense. You will pay dearly for your mockery. I can't. Oh well. You can't even make a joke on to anyone. 
and they get all angry at you. Oh well. Don't have enough mana. Need mana. More mana needed. No, I'm not to identify the amulet. That's neat. Which one is it? Yeah, we'll see later. After we clean this group. Cleaned everything from one hit. There we go. Oh, this is a new one. This is a new amulet for me. Pawn of small victories. That's a nice essence capacity, damn it. Might actually be better, be better than the riddle box for Katarina. We'll check it later. There's just a pile of bones here. Nothing else. Funeral pyre. Title says the real Hell's Kitchen. Recipes and exotic seasonings for Titan meat. <laughs> the real Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what is that? Gordon Ramsay reference. Okay, they will cl they will clean the enemy while I loot this chest. Blood powder, blood puddle. Is this the is this really the route? What? More mana. Like, you'd never say that this area didn't connect to here. <laughs> Impressive. But what is this obsession with me? You've already thwarted my plans, destroyed the source of my power. Why do you want to kill an old creature with severe back pain and only a tiny horde of monsters left? When you betrayed me and threatened my world, you turned me into your nemesis. Obsession is part of that package. Do I detect some self-loathing? 
Do you blame yourself for trusting me? I never trusted you. I knew that you were evil. Excuse me, and who warned you that he was evil? Hmm? Still, I needed your help to defeat a genius with an army of living machines. I hoped that I could stop you before it was too late. I was wrong, and Borgova paid the price. See, it's all about your self-loathing. Isn't that liberating? Ponder on this while you fight for your life. Irritating I don't have prisoner map. seven. Oh, I didn't saw that on time and almost got killed. Let me just I'm gonna hate myself for this, but I'm gonna go back and investigate that area. There might be something here to do with the with this cookbook. And I might actually hate myself for not not checking it out. Yeah, looks ominous. I don't have enough mana. Really? There's really nothing here. <laughs> oh well. Let me just check something really fast. Because if I connect this... Okay, fuck it. There's nothing here. I went back a mile for nothing. Yeah, okay, back to where there are some actual enemies. One of those feeders. Katarina's full again.
fallen monster hunter. What? I was a feared monster hunter once. Chased the faceless Tsar to the deepest realms. Then I was betrayed. And the Titan Slayer relic was wrenched from my grasp. Now I'm trapped here. Mocked for eternity. I will succeed where you have failed. I should have told him I have the Titan Slayer. Ah. Yeah. I'm I, I'm not thinking this straight right now. Like, uh, of course, summon fifty of you. Okay, the turret actually continues blasting after it falls down. That's good to know. Bone choppers are nasty, and it's not helping the fact that my uh, turret was not attacking at all. Okay, we are getting to the end of the level. Ah. Oh, I need to go down. Okay. Now we're talking. More mana needed. This then so that our damage damage on the canister shell is maxed, which means that our hmm, eh, figured. which means that our mechanoids are also going to have better damage. Fragment of Kosha is death? For what? Oh, hello, Titan. Let's just return to town before we descend the tower. Of madness, torment, and all that comes. In shades. Between those two. And 
that usually happened here. This happened. Well, we lost. I'm the ready, Van Helsing. A real underground hideout. Fabulous. I think that you must sacrifice one of them in order to get the mission done. Or stuff like that. Cannot. Oh, this. The Evanescent. <laughs> I'll check this later. I'll just sell the stuff. Actually, s send the Chimera again. Go, find me gold. I still have my thirst under control, in case you want This reminds me of my army days. Just sell everything? Buy these two? <laughs> yes, it will work this time. Are you sure? Back to the tower tour. And let's descend the tower. Oh, another spider elevator here. No, 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 just you remain bugged. There. I don't have enough. Okay, we'll take half of, half of his, his, his HP and damage. Seems like a female titan. I'm kind of sad you cannot see the entirety of her right now, like from head to toe. The tower is kind of obscuring her, which is kind of sad. Okay, they got destroyed. More mana needed. Just when you think that the area is not gonna be immense, you reach the bottom level and it's you figure out it's still gigantic. for a treasure chest that's probably gonna drop nothing. That's not good. 
three of them, so I'm gonna stop first. Or what are the the only helicopter throw? Again another talk. Why don't you just give up? It shouldn't end like this. This is your last chance to turn back. Did you hear that? Bargaining. The last stage of arch-villain <laughs> breakdown. Enough of this, Van Helsing. You win. Yes, you win. But you'll never take me alive. Never. That was disappointing. Our wretched prey knows that he doesn't have a chance. We have cornered him in his hiding uh. hole. Let's follow him through the gate and end this. Not impossible. So let's see how this goes. We might be actually getting close to the end of the game. Which is cool. We gotta finish Helsing. Just as planned. If that is the case. The Void Cathedral. Okay, let's do this. What? We get full cinematic? Um, is this the hiding hole where we have cornered our wretched prey? Just to make sure we are in the right place. I meant that metaphorically, Katarina. Whatever this creature has become, this will be the end of him. Good, good. You had me a bit worried there for a second, with this eerie chamber beyond time and the dragon and all. <laughs> Is there actually any reason for us to skill anything right now? I think we are maxed. Oh, we are not. Oh, just the power-ups here that I don't really use. Oh well, let's give this. And explore this weird place. Oh, is it really gonna be? Oh no. Okay, this actually makes more sense. I was hoping it was not gonna be an ending platform of us. What games am I planning to do next? Hmm. I thought... I thought... Oh boy. Uh, I thought about stuff like uh, probably the first Tomb Raider. Maybe a Mafia 1. Maybe something else. I'll... I'll see about it. I'm not really sure. My, my. You look surprised, Van Helsing. Did you expect an evil monologue? That's the least you could do. Professional courtesy and all. But we had that covered at the tower. Now you only have to die. He is scary. Oh, so wait, you activate- Oh, you activate that and destroy the ads. I wasn't aware- Jesus, the damage on the boy! Your chimera has returned from a success Fuck the chimera right now! I'm in the middle of a boss battle! I don't care about it! Kill all enemies in the presence, except the faceless one who takes 5,000 damage. Okay, that's good to know. It actually does that, but we're not gonna activate it right now. We'll keep it when more baddies spawn, and when we actually really need to use it. Because right around, 
right now, if I can actually just run around while my minions deal damage to him, and I don't fucking care, that's just gonna be cool, right? I mean, yeah, my minions do die very easily, but like... I don't have enough mana. I wonder if, if uh, stronger minions are gonna spawn when he reaches like the under 1 million HP bar. That could happen, right? Let's just spawn this. Here, spawn these guys here. Paralyzing kick. What? That ability is actually don't like that. I don't think actually I have any reason to activate the pillar. I might save it for really stuff. Bad moment. Prison a seven. He's a fucking undead dragon now, something like that. I mean, it makes sense that he would be something really mythological, considering that, that everything around him resolved to incredible amounts of manipulation. And a green dragon is actually a perfect example of that. If anyone knows what they represent from the end, from. Dungeons and Dragons. They're gigant. They're gigantic manipulators. <clears throat> I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have activated that potion. That was. Ah, that was just bad for me. Okay, let's just activate this right now. Clear some, make some room. See if we can actually run around enough for our health to regenerate. It will not regenerate because we are in a poison field. Is this permanent poison field? I'm not sure. I don't care. Play that game too many times already, and uh, I don't want to get into the Warcraft 3 reports. So, yeah, I'm gonna remember that game for all time's sake and uh, appreciate the time I had playing Dota 1 in there, but I am not willing to play Reign of Chaos again just simply because I played it like five, six times already. I'm, I'm probably just want to concentrate on games that I haven't played and I want to experience for the first time, so like uh, yeah, I did play Mafia 1 like a long a long time ago and I finished it uh, and it's one of my favorite games and I might actually because of that go for a uh, Something that I've never played, which might be... Oh, come on, do not kill me right now. So I might actually, because of that, go for something that's, that's new to me, and that will probably be the Tomb Raider series. Or the first game. For now. And if I like it, I might actually buy the other ones. And see. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, I don't want to go with with familiar games too much and oh, stuff man. like that. I mean, I could go and play... I could play... I was actually thinking about playing Diablo 2 from a normal to hell on a class. On some class, actually. I don't even know which one. Because in the in my free time, I actually playing Diablo 2 with a Necromancer, a summoner. And I was just like... I'm not gonna do that probably for the stream because I'm already finishing the game. I'm in Act 4 on Hell and I literally need just like two days to finish it, like a day one for Act 
four and then day five to go reach bail and just kick his ass and kill so yeah come on 70 50 20 got him That can't be everything, right? That cannot be everything. That must be literally a stage one, right? That was kinda too easy for this class. Yep. Now you are making me angry, Van Helsing. I'm glad to hear that. I used to be Koshai the Deathless, the Faceless Tsar. The immortal monarch of Borgovia. I ruled this land for centuries. And you would have got away with it if it weren't for those meddling <laughs> Trust me. It won't happen again. This could be the reference. What the fuck? Total must love torment, what? I can't do that. So he's probably gonna sp So he's probably just going to like go and summon uh, additional totems every fucking time. There is an uh, amount of HP lost. I think that's how my this might go. Fuck off, Nosferatu. Oh, actually, I didn't. Oh no, this is bad. Don't have range. Don't have range. Where are you? Oh, you actually returned here, dragon. Oh, that's slow torment. Come on, destroy it for... Oh, for crying out loud. Fuck this. Fuck that. Destroy this. That's a big ass number. 3 million and 500 H... 500,000 HP for a boss. But it is epic for a final boss. And this is the second stage. Come on, Nosferatus, die, you bastards, before you start stealing my life and wreaking havoc upon my ass. Come on, where are you gonna summon? When are you gonna summon your bastard? Don't have enough range. Okay, so you are starting to summon again your totems. One destroyed. Second destroyed. Are you gonna summon the third? You don't seem like... Okay, there it is. Destroyed that one. So he started. Did he actually wear armor? Totem of invincibility. There we go. Some of this there. Some of these guys to the back. Get the three of them. Did we know? Okay, we didn't. Unlucky. But oh well. Actually, might try changing my strategy here. Just spreading. Sp uh, I should spread all of my uh, summons most that I can because, like the ta the turret is going there uncontested. Nothing is targeting it. It's just it's, it can just pour oblivion from be from beyond, and that's good. Okay, I almost went into that one. 
the totem on draining going down. Okay, so let's change our position a little bit. Destroy these totems. Because, okay, we destroyed that totem. However, we need to destroy the totem of invincibility. There we go. I don't like those Nosferatus. If they get a hold of you, they can they can steal so much of your life and literally heal themselves to the top, killing you in the process. And that kinda sucks. So I really don't want that to happen to me. I need a little bit of mana. There we go. So yes! We got the max salmon there. That's good. Oh boy. Katarina got killed right now. That's kinda fine, I think. Like, as long as this turret is still standing, we're fine. Fuck you. We need to destroy the totems first. Okay, that totem actually got destroyed. Come on, destroy it. Thank you, Helsing. Destroy this one before it even spawns. <laughs> so he's stuck. He's not spawning more in us for us. Oh, no, no, it's still two. I just misjudged that because of the because of their placings. Oh no! Okay, they didn't hit me. If they hit me, if that hit me, I I just found out one thing. If the boss hits me one time, I am dead. Amazing! High stakes. So fuck that. <laughs> the poison blast will fucking murder me if, it, if I'm hit by it. Good work, turret. God damn it, that turret is good, doing, doing some amazing work. Alas, turret, you got, you've been destroyed or replaced. Deer, so they actually get a little bit of space. Come on, 300, 400,000 HP. Come on, come on. Where are you gonna show up? Koshai the Deathless, the dragon, my prey. Okay, not gonna get close to you. Obviously, I'm a ranged character, so. Actually, we yeah, are. Considering that uh, Divinity 2 had a new patch, so that might that might have fixed some of the problems that I had, and we might actually continue that. Oh yeah, yeah. The early access for Baldur's Gate 3 is on the 30th of September. Actually, if there is any if there is any way I can get into that, I will do it. I want to play that in early access. I want to see. Right through it, what they um, came up with. Come on! What? You're now regenerating? Yeah, piece of poo. Come on! Shoot him! Destroy him! Okay, this was the second stage. How many more can we expect? Probably one more. But usually, good things always comes in threes, right? Are you afraid of me, creature? You'll regret that my father didn't destroy you decades ago. Oh, but he thought he had. Only for me got he had other plans. He wanted to experiment on an immortal. So you became prisoner seven. They cut me open, took my wings and teeth, skinned me and bled me. From my bones and my blood, they created impossible creatures. They powered their first machines with my magic. A whole city crafted from the living corpse of a fallen god. That explains a lot. Great. He has started his grand speech. Keep him talking, Van Helsing. Do you have 
Counting on my sympathy. It's too late for that. You have ruined my transformation. Imagine what I could have been if you had destroyed my death. Too bad. Let's see what happens if I take away everything. Another stage. Five. What? Oh. Oh. Fuck. Oh crap, I see where this is heading. Oh boy. Five million. Five hundred thousand HP. Neat. How the fuck did that, that damage me? Also, I need to check this. Check. Okay, so I can heal if I am out of combat for five seconds. Actually, actually, if I am running the fuck out away from him, so that's a good thing to know if I'm in a pinch. That I can navigate to the situation and find myself at a little bit of a <laughs> literally destroyed Katarina. In one hit and again the turret is the MVP like just standing in the background and raining hell oh no are these those f oh no oh no okay change this what? One of them activated, right? Acolyte of the Faceless Czar. This is the final battle. Okay, all the bosses... ...are... Um, ...getting... Um, ...we're getting a little bit of a... ...throwback. Like, I'm not sure how I feel really about uh, boss gauntlets. This one might actually make some fucking sense. Let's just wait to heal. While I am... Um... Come on. Let me heal. Thank you. I like how the layout of the map looks like a claw or a hand, depends on how imaginative you are. Fortunately, you cannot get generate too much rage in this. Oh no, this is bad. This okay, they didn't target me. The Nosferatus are really disgusting here. Let me just. Wait a little bit. Katarina will respawn in a moment. We will make our little bastards and try to clear some of the ads before the Acul before the Acolyte shows up. So okay, they are all at one place. So I might actually want to go and do the most damage possible right now. Okay, we lowered him to three million and eight hundred thousand HP. Still going down, which is good. Yep. Oh fuck! 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 It. Yeah, that's the ability I was talking about, the disgusting one. Okay, we regenerated all of our HP, all of our mana. Let's turn around for another round of. Uh, fuck. Okay, fuck you. Ouch. Okay, that... For some weird reason that actually missed me and I'm really glad that it did. Oh, I am not sure I wanna go there. 
I do not want to aggro any 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 of the bosses. And I am probably gonna just aggro the queen. The spider queen when we get close to her. The master of the gate is there. Is this one activated? No, and I don't fucking care about it. But the acolyte of the... Okay, can we actually pick off the acolyte of the faceless czar right now? No. Oh, that's terrible for me. The platform is down. Katarina is going down. No summons at the moment. However, we did kill the acolyte of the faceless czar. Which is a, a mini boss in this gauntlet. Fuck off, Nosferatu. Stop targeting me for crying out loud. Come on, let me regenerate to my full HP. Or maybe not. That's also fine. Okay, all of my ads are still alive, which is miraculous at this point. So, they are doing some swift work. Oh no! Move! Good. Evaded that shit. Where are you, faceless... Czar? Is that... Is it too far? Yeah, it's too far, so we're gonna make a new turret that's hopefully going to shoot thank you you already got this right Fair. more summons infinite summons okay we got him to three million two hundred thousand hp Probably not a lot, but uh, I mean, it's uh, something. Okay, he got destroyed, that's cool. This one now. Uh... Oh, we actually turned off the gun platform. That was weird. Sucked. Why does this ability always miss when you attack from, from turning around? Like, what's the deal? <laughs> it's weird. That was a bit of damage on us. So let's actually just take a moment, go back, and heal. Good. That's what we wanted to do. That was terrible for me. Okay, he's under 3 million. So. Oh no, fuck you. Fuck you, Golem. Stay back. Stay back. Do not come closer! Damn it! I'm gonna turn off the platform so it can heal without getting destroyed. Even though it might actually be faster for it to be destroyed and then oh, oh fuck you! Not summoning near me, you bastard! Not a good place. More rage. Let's regenerate some HP. Fuck, my hands hurt. Now, this is how you make a boss battle. 
No, I shouldn't have made a new turret. That was my bad. Let's make this one here. And let's just go back for a couple of seconds, regenerate our HP. I mean, we cleared the fa the Acolyte of the Faceless Czar, so we got a little bit of time, but we don't want to aggro Judge Obrovsky. Or whatever his name is, I don't care. Let's just not get into a really bad position. We already have the Crystal Golem here, and we don't want the Master of the Gates and... Uh, the bla the Tarantula Queen to join us in uh, this fucking gauntlet. So, let's just do this from afar, like Jafar. No, my turret. Come on, die. Thank you. Oh no! Don't have Fuck! Oh no, it's actually fine. I thought we aggroed the Queen of Spiders. This is... This is tolerable. But I might actually want to run around... Before we aggro the Queen of Spiders and the Master of the Gates. And actually... Regenerate! Regenerate HP, please. Thank you. Good. Is the crystal golem gonna die soon? Yes. Good. Very good. This kind of reminds me of the Jotun final fight with a um, what's his name? Odin, when he can summon uh, the aspects of the enemies you've killed so far. But this is, this is a different type of gauntlet, you just like, they enter the arena, you destroy them. Fuck you, golem. Get destroyed. Come on, shoot, die. Thank you. Oh no, not you. Master of doors. Fuck. Sorry for the swearing and cussing, but this is, this is tense. Two million HP. Come on, Katarina. Regenerate. Get back into the fight. Thank you. Katarina. Okay, we, we changed her back into the form before she died. Which is amazing. We're not gonna lose too much on damage right now. So let's let's get back you let's get you back into the form. Let's also remove the gun platform a little bit from the combat. Katarina returned to the fight. Thank you. I don't have enough mana. Change the places of our summons. Make more summons. And reactivate the gun platform. This is not good. Katarina is down. Like, the worst part of this is my headphones are falling down. And I kind of hate it. <laughs> Nose dive to the ground. Okay, we'll wait a bit. For, okay, that was that was what we were waiting for. No, fuck that ability. It's really strong. It's really powerful, and we don't want to get slowed. So the dragon can, can catch up with us. Make this one here so it's out of their range and aggro. So it can shoot uncontested. Until it's destroyed, that is. But it's not getting destroyed yet, so I mean, that's fine, right? Oh no, this is not a good place to fight right now. I actually need to stick to this side a little bit. Turn on the platform, allow it to regenerate a bit. Fuck. Good. The, oh, that ability is nasty. That ability is really nasty. If you get hit by it, you, I mean, I mean, me to be honest, if I get hit by anything that the boss that the boss casts, I'm pretty much dead. So, need to be extra careful. However, we are lowering him down to a million HP. So, 
tough battle. Katarina, go into the spirit form so you can heal. Actually, that was amazing timing. You can go back here. Fuck off from me! Thank you. Ugh, the fat widow is here too. No! I don't want to aggro the last boss. I really don't want to aggro the last boss right now. Just, j j j just you rot away there, j Judge Obisovsky. Oh, obese. Because he's fat. <laughs> Good one. Come on. We actually need to deal with these first. I'm kind of sad if I cannot kill the Master of Doors while this one is alive. Kind of sucks. Jesus, my hands are sweating. And this is actually really fucking tense. So. All of our minions, all of our summons are getting practically destroyed. However, we have infinite summons. So we don't fucking care. Should deactivate it, Katarina. There's a little bit of a delay before that damage hits. No, 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 not this ability. F you. No. No, not, don't bug me now in the wall. Thank you. Okay, we lowered him to about. We lowered him below 1 million HP. Uh, I said we lowered you. Under me, thank you. Rage. Come on, Karina, go into the ghost form, regenerate. The platform is also gonna get back in a second, which is always good. We're gonna summon these in the meantime while the doctors are cool down. Oh, for fuck's sake, again, I missed. I want to deal with the Fat Widow first. the fat widow. There she is. Like, a very good thing is that Katarina, every time she dies, uh, her explosion does a shit ton of damage. And I'm actually counting on that and sometimes to clear the ads. Come on, fat widow. Return to the hell of divorce from whence you came. Because you ate all of your husbands. And you shouldn't be pestering me anymore. Thank you. Okay. Under 700,000 HP. That's fine. No, 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 no. Single power, which is no, 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 get over here. Good, Katarina, go in that uh, form. Okay, nice. Now we should be able to deal with him. No, too close for comfort. Almost died due to a lack of concentration. Good thing we didn't. Come on, come on, soon, soon we got him. Need to summon another turret. 200,000 HP. And going down rapidly, I might add. Make a new one because the last turret is gone. We did it. We did it. 
I can't believe it. We did it, Van Helsing. Koshai. The devil is his... Well, dead. Thank you, Katarina. Thank you very much for everything. Wait. Why are you so serious? You are acting strange. It is time to set you free from your arcane bonds. You've earned this. I hereby release you from the services of the Van Helsing family. Great. It was about time. Well, yes. It's just... <coughs> never mind. Oh, did you expect a teary-eyed, grateful speech? You should know me better, Van Helsing. I've earned this indeed. <laughs> I am free! At last! <laughs> That's it, then? We part our ways. Are you insane? Absolutely <coughs> not. I'll stay with you. Beg your pardon? <laughs> you won't get rid of me that easily. But if I want to be your companion, it's been an interesting unlife so far. I'm glad. I really am. And you can't order me to stay away. <laughs> That's the beauty of it. I might have second thoughts about this, you know. Don't be silly, Van Helsing. Let's go. You don't want to miss all the other adventures the world can offer you, right? We've done it! I came to Borgovia to free this land from evil. And I kept my promise. I defeated a mad scientist, fought a military genius, and put a stop to Koshe's grand plan. Still, these villains caused too much destruction and pain. I saved Borgovia, but it has become a ruined city, where the ink is spilling free, twisting reality, and opening gates to the other world. However, it is also a new beginning. We can rebuild Borgova into a new metropolis, where mythical creatures and ordinary people can live among the marvels of weird science. One thing is for sure. My adventure ends here. And whatever follows, it will be another story. And that's how Kekai Sensen starts. <laughs> We've done it! Nine parts. Nine parts and we finished it. Let's enjoy the credits. To be honest, one of the more innovative and genius end credits to the game. It shows you everywhere where you've been, from where you started, where you went. It just gives you an overall amazing feel at the end of the game that it's been a long with your journey man this game was really pleasant to play and then finally such a long time and such a nice reward and hey we, we killed the, the final boss without dying we did come close once to dying but <laughs> we kind of did skip one mini boss in the boss gauntlet. But that's fine. Everything is fine. 
because now we finished Van Helsing. We can go on to some other game tomorrow. It was not like that. Miroslav Korbat, he's one of the he's one of the resistance fighters in the secret layer. And thus we conclude our gameplay of the incredible adventures of Van Helsing. I just is the last boss there? No, it's not. We have done it, my friends. This was very good. So, <sighs> what now? What now? What now?